All right, this is how I finished almost half of my master's in just two months. Um, to be fully transparent, it's more like 44%, but it's close enough. Uh, the program is at WGU, which stands for Western Governors University, and it's a, a self-paced program, so you can go through the coursework as fast as you want or as slow as you want. On the screen here, uh, the courses in green are the courses I've already completed, and the ones in white are the ones that I still have to work on. So if we scroll to the bottom here, you can see I've taken data mining and analytics, statistics for data analysis, orientation, advanced data visualization, R for data analysis, programming in Python, and fundamentals of data analytics. You can see the course I'm working on now in white is SQL for data analysis, and then for term two, I'm registered for SAS programming one and two, and then data mining and analytics two. And then finally is the data analytics graduate capstone. And then here are some of the reasons I think I've been able to go through the first half of my master's so quickly compared to traditional programs at least. Uh, the first one is previous experience. For example, my R and Python classes were pretty easy for me to go through just because Python's a relatively easy programming language and I'd have experience programming before. And then in undergrad, I had a lot of experience working with R, so I was able to get through that pretty fast as well. And then study skills, I think, are hugely important in these self-paced programs because you really have to decide on your own which information is important and which inf information um, you can kind of gloss over. And then secondly, you need to find ways to get this information to stick in your head fast. And then sacrificing time seems kind of obvious, but it's huge. The more time that you're willing to sacrifice and the more time you can put into studying and doing your coursework, the more you're gonna get out of these courses and the quicker you're gonna get through the program. And I didn't wanna put this last one in, but I think it matters especially in online courses where you're administering yourself because you can get so hung up on 100% mastering the concepts when in reality no one in traditional programs are doing these things. They're learning the core concepts and they're moving on. So if you can get comfortable getting really proficient at a topic and then move on, I think you'll succeed.